acting like they did was. You was never Good morning, everyone. It's another day, which means another opportunity, new blessings, so on and so forth. Today's a busy day. So right now, I actually, I'm gonna start on with my follow-ups and I have a good lump sum to go through. So that's gonna take a little bit of time. And a little bit of an update in regards to um, yesterday, since I didn't have like a vlog type style video yesterday. Um, and for, so for the new development piece that like we're working on, I actually got a email of a, like a proposal quote for the architect side of things. So that was just from one architect and the price literally like it blew my mind. Like I cannot believe architects were that pricey, right? So I thought it'd probably be around like, you know, maybe, maybe close to 10,000 or below. And I was like, all right, you know, that'd be smooth, that'd be fine. But the quote they gave was 52,000 and some change but I mean, I know like it's gonna pay off in the long run, but after I looked at it and was running some numbers, I was like, okay, this honestly may not be too bad, but always get other quotes. So I still have other people I wanna reach out to, other companies that still need to get back in touch with me, and then a new company I'm gonna reach out to today, so I'm, I have that on my list to do. Um, but that's just an update in regards to that side of things. Like I'm still in the process of finding an architect. Um, Another thing I have to do is my sister actually got a driving for dollars lead. So I skip traced it two days ago and I was calling it and stuff. The main person I could not get a hold of, like all the numbers are literally like um, out of service numbers. So that's when you go to the family members. So I've been calling the family members, nothing back yet. So you just continue to follow up. So I have to do that. I have to send an email out of a deal breakdown. So this is actually the property I saw, I think it was like two days ago, um, and walked through it and I have that on a video. So if you guys wanna check that out, walk through it. And this is just with the agent in place as well. And I was on the phone with her yesterday, basically explained like a novation of what we could do where the property stays in the seller's name. We just do like necessary repairs if needed and then you know we put it on the market and i wouldn't be listing it i would allow her to list it so the agent wins we win we have a small profit and then we're part we would partner with um the person that found this deal so we would split that 50 50 you know he gets a profit as well and then, and then the seller would be able to get like slightly a higher price than what she was expecting so it's basically a win-win for everyone so that's great i gotta send that over so i also have to make a list a probate list and so we have a stack of probates, but I have to skip trace it so we can have that ready for our caller to cold call it. And then our other VA, she sent me like financial stuff I have to go through. So I got to take a look at that today. I have to create a new lease for a new tenant that just moved in, which is super exciting. So, well, sh sh they didn't move in yet, but like they're getting ready to move in. So you want to make sure you get that lease first before they actually move in and then respond to DMs and YouTube comments, all that stuff, post on social media, TikTok for Investors Unite. And then we got a podcast coming out later today, which is exciting. So if you guys wanna check out our podcast, I'll leave a link down below, or you can just type in Investors Unite on YouTube and it will pop up or on Apple and Spotify as well. But with that being said, I also gotta do probates later and I gotta stack. So it's a busy day, but it's gonna be a good one. Go like this video, go subscribe. With that being said, let's get to work. I'm doing pretty good, I can't complain. <laughs> I wanted to give you a quick call just to let you know. Um, I've been reaching out to a good amount of architects. I'm gonna do some more today because I did get a quote yesterday. Their fee consists of verify city codes, program analysis, design, design development, construction documents with the drawing and specifications, and then bidding. And that came to 52500 So that's why I want to see like the difference between the, you know, other companies and stuff. Awesome. Well, yeah, I'll keep you posted as, you know, I hear more things from different architects and we'll go from there. Super nice guy. Really nice seller. So he's working with us with everything. Truly appreciate him. He's guiding us through the process, basically. So, like, he's guiding us, but I'm also, like, reading books about it, 
watching a lot of YouTube in regards to new construction. Like, I'm going back. YouTube University is where it's at. So, um, yeah, it's a process, but it's so much fun. Like, the process of everything, of learning and, you know, seeking new things, doing new things is such a fun process. No, because I think I think that they think the thermostat yeah. is a doorbell. That's what I think. Yeah. So I'll okay, I'll let them know with that, but um what else was it? So it was the sink the sink and then the electric part with some lights. Yeah, and they were working when I was there. Maybe, it, do you have like a plug you can take just to make sure those outlets work in the bedrooms? And then the smoke alarm. So we can, we can, um, I can cash app you or however you want to go about it. I mean, they don't need, you don't need a doorbell. People can knock on the door. <laughs> Muchas gracias. I mean, de nada. De nada. All right, hasta luego. Bye. All right, guys. So I've been sitting here working, making lots of calls, responding to emails, um, a lot of different stuff that revolves around real estate. And I got an email in regards to another architect that sent me a quote of like where we would be around, and their prices. I mean, we're looking close to six figures. Even if we don't make a lot of money on this new construction deal, I am completely fine. Like I'm literally just focused on learning the game, learning the process from like A to B, right? It's just like, if you have a car, it don't need to be brand new, but as long as it takes you from A to B, you're solid. So like, I want this, I mean, this would be the first construction deal. So I want to learn the process of everything. So we'll see who we end up choosing. With that being said, I now have to dive into the MLS here to comp a property one more time. I wanna see what price we'd be at in regards to the innovation of what we can offer the seller and then what price we'd be able to sell at on the market. And I have to break it down to, uh, to the other agent because within like this industry, there are a lot of agents that believe wholesaling is illegal, they think you can't do it. They um, believe like novations are illegal, but no, like you definitely can do this stuff. In certain states, I believe you can't wholesale or um, you, you can't possibly wholesale without a license, but in PA, it's all, you know, solid, solid and good. So she just wants me to explain like the process of like the novation and how the deal would be structured, which I was like, yeah, most definitely I can do that. So. Right now, I just got to work on the pricing of things of like what we can offer and then email her the deal structure of how we can, you know, how it's going to go about. Oh, I actually think, I think this call right here is from one of the architects. Let's see. I'm good. How are you? Who's this? Yes. Yes. I was uh, calling in regards to, I'm looking for an architect out. So we're looking to do a total of eight units. Yep, so the square footage, they have it on public records of like 5,600 square feet, but it doesn't really specify if that's the lot size or if that's the size of the building. Awesome, awesome. Well, I truly appreciate it. And yeah, I'll send that over to you right now then. All right, so I just scheduled a time to meet with another architect at the property. Hopefully we can, you know, make some numbers work. We shall see, but I do want to see, you know, um, previous work. Like I want to always look at the previous work. Cause like I said, I want this to look really nice. So I've been working all morning and it has been a really productive day. Got a lot of stuff done and I'm ahead of schedule. So that's really good. Um, so right now I did make some coffee. I'm gonna have my little almond break in a little bit, but I do wanna finish the lease first. So fill out the lease, send it over to them. So we have that all situated since they're gonna move in this weekend.
so that's gonna be it for today's video i am still working on the probate so got a lot of work to do in regards to that but should get done in a little bit here um and then finally can have something to eat but i hope you guys enjoyed if you did give it a thumbs up go subscribe if you're not subscribed with that being said i'll catch you on the next one peace